You are watching EAC News. Thanks for joining us. The Cambodian People's Party held a central committee meeting on Friday morning, where they unanimously agreed to vote for Prime Minister Hun Sen as Prime Minister in the upcoming 2023 elections, and to endorse Hun Manit as the future prime ministerial candidate. The Central Committee also elected two senior members of the CPP as the party's vice presidents. EAC News reporter Dishan Egochan has more details. The 43rd Central Committee meeting of the fifth mandate of the CPP was held at the party's headquarters on Friday morning, where members of the party unanimously agreed to endorse Hun Manet as the future candidate for Prime Minister of Cambodia. The party also unanimously agreed to vote for Prime Minister Hun Sen as Prime Minister during the next term election in 2023. Additionally, the Central Committee elected the Minister of Defense, Thie Ban, and the Minister of National Assembly, Senate Relations and Inspection, Men Saman, as the party's new vice presidents. The CPP now has four standing vice presidents, including Senate President Tsai Chum and Deputy Prime Minister and Minister of Interior, Saw King. The Central Committee meeting was held under the chairmanship of Prime Minister Hun Sen, President of the CPP, and National Assembly President Heng Samrin, Honorary President of the CPP. According to the official statement on the outcomes of the Central Committee meeting released by the CPP, 775 out of a total of 865 members were in attendance. The statement continued that the conference was held in the spirit of unity, democracy, and the highest responsibility for the cause of the nation and the people. The statement includes that the Central Committee calls on members of the CPP at all levels to strengthen solidarity and internal unity and to strive to continue to implement the party's political programs and decisions successfully to serve the highest interests of the nation and its people and to maintain peace, independence, sovereignty, and territorial integrity at the highest order so that Cambodia can be strong and stable forever. At the same time, the Central Committee asks all members to continue strictly implementing health safety measures to prevent the resurgence of COVID-19 and to work together to restore and develop Cambodia's socioeconomic situation after the pandemic. Darshana Gauchan, EAC News.